Dallas Police Chief Renee Hall speaking out today about her department's overtime budget, which has become a big flashpoint in the ongoing debate over what some people are calling defunding the police. Our Jack Fink is on this today with what Chief Hall had to say about it all. Jack. Well, Doug, Chief Renee Hall met virtually with the Dallas City Council's Public Safety Committee to talk about her plan to combat violent crime in the city, which is up about 3.5% year to year. And, of course, she faced questions about her overtime budget. And this all became even more of a touchy subject last Thursday when Governor Greg Abbott sharply criticized council members for cutting $7 million from the department's overtime budget. Most of that money, more than $4 million, will go toward programs unrelated to public safety. Today, Chief Hall sought to assure council members and the community that despite what council members decided, officers will not stop their efforts to fight crime and will continue to do their jobs. We are not going to compromise the safety of our community regardless uh, to what happens around the horseshoe. Uh, we will continue to provide the service. We will continue to utilize our officers on overtime. And if that means we come back to you and say we need additional resources, then that's what we're going to do. And the Dallas Police Association President Mike Mata told us recently that Council members are simply playing a shell game because Chief Hall or any other chief after her could come back to the city council and ask for more money for the overtime budget. Council members will take their final vote on the budget next week, and it will go into effect October 1st. Reporting live, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News.